Newport. We are leaving Newport. It's a little bit, uh, a little bit crazy streets there. Very locals only sort of place in terms of how the streets are set up. But we got a cheap stay. We're on our way to Astoria, from what I can gather. And given the given the uh, the day at hand, it appears to be a sunny one, despite what the morning was giving us. So um, we're hoping we're hoping to make it much further north today to Oregon, uh, northern Oregon, and up toward Washington. Let's see what we can see up there. And yeah. Um, we're heading up to the lady in GPS. <laughs> yeah, we're uh, we're heading up to Astoria right now, which would make perfect sense if we just stayed on 101. And I'm sure Gladys knows this, but instead she decided to direct us to take a random right. So now we're on a 12-mile detour back to 101 for some fucking reason, because Gladys is kind of a bitch like this. <laughs> Pleasant. There's a big rock over there. There's a big fucking rock over there. It's called Haystack Rock. Sometimes when the tide's really low, like really, really low, you can walk up to it. Otherwise, you can't because, you know, fucking ocean after all. That's yeah, pretty broken. But it's purple and white. Yeah, I know, but don't keep it because it's I'm like not, broken. I'm not going to keep it. It's pretty broken. But... Okay. Shit. Lovely. Got another log. It was a lot more magical the last time I was here. You know, like when the toilets flushed and like things worked and like there was like kind of a little bit of sun and it was July so it was actually warm here because not terribly warm today. But hey guys, this is the ocean. Welcome to the ocean again. There will probably be lots of cool things to collect. Yeah. What now? Those might be jellyfish. I'm not gonna touch them anymore. That's probably a smart thing. Washington. The town itself is in this giant hill right in front of us. Um, yeah, so we're going to drive through that. We'll probably cross that bridge, actually. I'm not entirely sure. Keep it on. Keep it on. So well, I can't on. record that long. Oh. Okay. So I have to do it in cycles. Here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Otherwise, it's a really long video and I have to cut out a bunch of dumb shit. So here we are at Pig and Pancake. Apparently, they serve both pig 
and pancake. We're getting the crab legs with hollandaise sauce and, and eggs benedict and the clam strips. So we're getting neither pig nor pancake for some stupid reason. But we will eventually get pig and also pancake. Should have just got pancakes. We could also get pancakes and split pancakes. So this was the pig and pancake. I can't see the freaking logo from here. It, it, it's it's back here. away. Last two uh, two summers ago, I stayed up in one of these houses way up here. Um, you can't see it. Nope. It, might, it might be further down the street, but it was an orange house with um. No, you mean up the street? Up the street. Well, down that way and then up. Uh, but okay. Down down that way and then up. Um, but yeah, it was uh, an orange house, and the shutters were painted to look like piano keys. So it's it was it was a pretty obvious joint to find. I want to meet their dog. <clears throat> they got a dog and a and a Winnebago over there. They look cool. They have two dogs. Hello, my <laughs> name is Ken Kesey, and you can find the statue of me in Eugene, Oregon. Which we already passed through. Which we already went through. And we didn't we didn't stop to see the statue. Did we forget about the statue? We forgot about the statue, but we'll be. It's because we were trying to contact your something. friend who was like, I have a kid in a life now, sorry. I mean, I get it. Yeah, that's cool. And we'll, we'll see you again, Alicia. And, uh, and yeah. Um, uh, yeah, it's pretty cool out here. It's got the, uh, <clears throat> got that seafaring vibe. Yes, it's quite a seafaring town, for sure. Mmm. Mmm. <clears throat> I want to go meet that dog. <laughs> I want to go meet that dog and roll a joint for those people. Mmm, I'd, I'd pass. We should probably get the move on before it gets dark tonight. All so. right, it'll, maybe they'll let, them st let us stay with them in their lovely Winnebago. I, I'm sure they're packed to capacity for themselves. So how many hippies not. can you fit in a Winnebago? I don't know, how many? Ah, uh, under the soap. Wait. Wait. What? How do you hide money from a hippie? That's under the soap. Ding. Yeah, I've heard that one before. Okay, let's get that logo before we. Pig and pancake. Pig and pancake. We're don't getting run there. Into the don't run into Jeddah. the. Don't run into the car. Don't run into the Jetta. Yes. <laughs> or what is it? What is it? A Scirocco? Or is it a rabbit? Is it a? It's a Jetta. I was it, right. It is a Jetta. Yeah. Anyway. It's always a. Pig Jedi. and pancake. Best like little diner seafood. Pancakes, obviously, that you can get. I don't know what he's doing. I'm, I'm just trying to navigate to Longview Kelso, the Econo Lodge in Longview Kelso. Um, so yeah, we're gonna do the, the navigation business here and then we'll be <coughs> back on the road. As soon as we cross that, we will no longer be in Oregon. And from there on, we will try to find the cheapest lodging, which seems to be the Econo Lodge. Here, right. So yeah, there's a bridge out over there too. I don't know if we'll be crossing it or not. It's entirely possible. It's very industrial out here, but it's pretty neat all the same. Pretty neat stuff. space between the, the, the towering purgatory above the Columbia River is absolutely enchanting. <laughs> Entering Washington, official Washington side of the bridge now. I guess we could say we're officially home since this is the state we are transplanting ourselves to. 
No, it's just a couple of miles to our lodging, and from here on out, we're gonna figure out what our plan is. Yeah. Start looking for jobs, try to find anybody, anybody out there anybody. who has a room to offer us anybody. very temporarily until we get on our feet. Of course, by the time this video goes up, we'll probably already be pretty stable. So, hopefully. Yeah, so by the time you guys are watching this stuff, you won't have to worry that things are like really horrible for us. So, yeah. I'm pretty excited to start this new chapter in life and, and start fresh and do things and yeah, pretty yeah. excited stuff. So, there. so we'll we'll chat again once we reach our motel. And yeah, hopefully um yeah, I'm gonna work on some more video stuff tonight and hopefully get another one up. And uh, yeah, so if you guys haven't seen any of my previous uh, travel videos, please uh, check the Mm, Exodus out of the Midwest playlist for all of them. Try to watch them in order because it doesn't really make sense otherwise.